Hey guys, this is Ganesh. Welcome back to Ganesh Jada Automation Studio. So today we are going to learn about how to configure Maven project to your existing Java project. So most of the student have the same question. If uh, they are having the existing Java project and they wanted to enable, they wanted to enable the uh, Maven into that existing Java project. So how exactly we can do these things? So I'm just showing I'm just showing you the uh, showing you the example from the scratch. Like here, this is my IntelliJ IDEA tool, and here I'm just creating the Java project. So here I'm just creating the Java project. Here I'm just selecting the click on this next button, and here I just need to as it as it is project template I'm selecting, and here I'm just creating the next project. So here I'm just giving the name of my project like Java <coughs> Java project example. example for maven so this uh, this is straightforward uh, project i am going to create over here and here i am just uh, clicking on this finish button once i click on the finish button this this pop up will will open here i need to click on the new button so once i click on the new button here you can see this java straightforward project is created only here you can see java src folder is created if i am creating this project with the maven so two folders is created under this src main and main and test because of maven is support for the page object model structure so so now if you wanted to add now if you wanted to add the add the maven uh, maven framework in this existing project so how we can add so simple step we need to follow guys so on this project you need to uh, on this project you, you need to select this project and on this project you need to right click over here once you click on the right click here on the second line you can see the option add framework support it means uh, add framework support whatever you would like so here i am clicking on this add framework support and here you can see groovy kotlin maven these three four three options you will have so here i am just click if you wanted to add the add support for the groovy you can simply click if you would like to add the support for the Kotlin, you can simply click over here. And if you would like to add the support for the Maven, you simply click on this Maven support. So here I'm just adding the support for the Maven. I'm unchecking this, these two options. And here I need to click on the OK button. Okay. Once I once I click on the OK button, here you can see my Maven like com.xml file will automatically generate. And once I added the Maven framework support in this framework, you can see in the src folder you can see this two folder is automatically created like src java and and test like main java and and test so these two folders are automatically created it means my folder like like for my java project maven is automatically enabled over here this thing i wanted to tell you guys this is simple pretty straightforward steps we need to follow i hope this this folder this this video is, is you really like this video and this video will really helpful for you thanks for watching this video guys if you really uh, like this video please please do like please subscribe my channel uh, thanks thanks for watching guys thank you